A car starting from rest accelerates at the rate f through a distance s. Then continues at constant speed for time t and then decelerates at the rate f by 2 to come to rest. If the total distance travelled is 15 s, yes, then given problem a car starting from rest. Initial speed of the car is 0. Accelerates at the rate f through a distance s and then continues at a constant speed for time t and then decelerates at the rate f by 2 and again it comes to rest. If the total distance travelled is 15 s yes, then which relation is correct? So initially car is at rest position. u is equals to 0 and the car accelerates at the constant rate f and cover a distance s yes. and after up to certain time t seconds it continues the same speed so here initial speed is 0 final speed let it be v and up to t seconds it continues the same speed take this point a and this point b so a to b acceleration is equals to 0 why because it continues with the same speed at b point and at a point the speed is a constant so at this point initial speed is a v only but after then it decelerates, speed decreases and again at this point C, final speed again becomes to 0. Here decelerations is F by 2. From O to A, initial speed 0, distance S. Yes. So here S1 is equals to S. Yes. We know equation V square minus u square is equals to 2as from o to a acceleration is equals to f so v square minus 0 is equals to 2 into f into here s1 is s so v square is equals to 2fs and from this v is equals to square root of 2fs now from A to B, acceleration is 0 and the initial speed is V, the time is T. Distance travelled, let it be S2, S2 is equals to speed into time. U is equals to V. We know V is equals to square root of 2Fs. 2Fs into T. And now from B to C. At B point initial speed is V. Square root of 2Fs. And final speed is 0. Distance travelled, let it be S3. And here, this is a decelerations. So, A minus A, it becomes minus A, F by 2. So, from equations of motion, V square minus U square is equals to 2A, S. So, final speed is 0 minus Initial speed square root of 2 F S. Then it becomes 2 F S is equals to 2 into. This is negative acceleration minus F by 2. And distance S3. Yes, 2, 2 get cancelled minus cancelled with each other. And F also cancelled. Then S3 yes, is equals to 2 Yes. Total distance. 
S1 plus S2 plus S3 is equals to here in given question total distance travelled is 15 yes so substitute here S1 plus S2 plus S3 is equals to 15 yes S1 is equals to yes plus S2 is equals to square root of 2FS into T plus S3 is equals to 2S. Simplify this. S plus 2S 3S. So square root of 2FS into T is equals to 15S minus 3S. That is equals to 12 s yes. for the simplification squaring on both sides two f s yes into t square is equals to 12s whole square becomes 144 into s square. Here 2 ones, 2 72s. And 1 s also get cancelled. And from this s is equals to 1 by 72 into f into t square. f t square. So, S is equals to 1 by 72 FT square. S is equals to 1 by 72 FT square. Third option is correct.